In this video, we'll discover about how to bounce back from past failures. It is not good enough to know the benefits of starting over and banishing the past. You also have to know how to go about starting the new journey. Many people desire to let go of the past and focus on the present. However, many fail because they lack the skills and information to do it right. This chapter will empower you with the knowledge and skills you need to start this new journey. Treat the past as a lesson. According to psychologists, intelligence is the ability to learn from experience to make better decisions in the future. Therefore, whoever does not learn from the mistakes of the past cannot be referred to as an intelligent person. You should be able to draw out lessons from your experience to improve your decision making. For example, if you have been in an abusive relationship before, you should remember those factors that made you surrender yourself to a dictator. If it was because you depended on him or her for sustenance, then you should not enter another relationship until you have a job. You need to empower yourself and be valuable by making your own money. In the same way, if it was because you had low self-esteem, you need to work on that before entering a new relationship. You should be learning from what has happened to you in the past to avoid making the same mistakes. Unfortunately, some people don't learn from their experience. Instead of learning, they react and make even worse decisions. For example, some people can decide to be harsh towards any opposite sex that comes around them to get revenge for what their ex did to them. That approach is ridiculous. You should not become cranky and grumpy because of the way someone treated you. Rather, you should pick the lessons from your experience and use them to make better decisions in the future. Surround yourself with positive people. There are people who will always remind you about your past with every opportunity they have. Such people shouldn't be in your circle of friends. They generate negative emotions because they want you to feel bad about yourself. They also act that way to remind you that they are better than you. It doesn't matter whether such people are members of your family. They don't deserve your association. Stay off them. Unfortunately, such insensitive people are not only physically present, they are also on social media. They will throw jibes at you just to have fun without caring how you feel. Even celebrities are not immune to such insensitive remarks. Some people have had to deactivate their social media accounts because they were targets of cyberbullying activities. If you find yourself in that kind of situation, you should stay off social media for a while. Stay more around people that will see you as a human being who can make a mistake. Such people will give you the chance to slowly mend your broken vessel and prepare to sail again. They will provide you with the emotional support you need to see the past as a lesson so that you can forge ahead. We all need such people in our lives. Moreover, you should also be that kind of person towards others. Sometimes the reason some people are quick to condemn us is that we have been quick to judge others in the past. Leverage your strengths. One of the best ways you can build your self-esteem, especially after it has been battered, is to stick with things that allow you to express your strength. There is a place for learning and acquiring skills to carry out a task successfully. However, you will make your journey smoother when you do those things that maximize your abilities and minimize your deficiencies. If we all learn to do the things we can do best, we will be lauded as celebrities in our own right. However, due to the pressure to make ends meet, many people are doing jobs that do not allow them to express their creativity. This limitation is often the case when working in a highly bureaucratic organization. The need to seek the permission of a superior before implementing an idea often make many people less productive than their capacity. Avoid being under the spotlight or immense pressure when starting over to avoid harsh criticism in case of a mistake. Don't hide or run away from responsibilities because of your setback. However, it will be better for you if you can start working your way up from an environment with less scrutiny. Use that period to build your confidence and trust in your ability again. It helps when you are with people who allow you to get back to your previous level without judging you during this phase. Receive more training. It is crucial that you admit when you know that you don't have what it takes to carry out a task. One of the reasons some people fail in a project is overconfidence. Low self-esteem is not good. However, overconfidence can also make you make mistakes that will be difficult to correct. So don't demand a role you know you don't have the skills to perform. Even when you are being offered such a position, you should be honest enough to turn it down unless you will be allowed to learn on the job. In the same way, some people get into the wrong romantic relationships because they are naive. Young people are fond of making such mistakes because they feel no one understands how they feel. They will not inform their parents about the relationship until something goes wrong. They could have impregnated themselves already before the parents are aware of what is going on. They will not inform their parents about the relationship until something goes wrong. You should be open to learning from more experienced people in every aspect of life. You will not make the mistakes older people have made in their relationships if you seek their counsel. Learn to ask the right questions from the right people. You don't have to invest and lose your money before you learn your lessons. There are always people that have invested in that sector before. Successful people are known for their willingness to learn from others. 
If you're going to turn your life around after a setback, you must be more open to learning. For more free educational content, visit learnforfree.biz. Content produced and distributed by AllSuperInfo.